Bonjour à tous. Ooh. Thank you, Pastor Walter and Pastor uh, Jean-Paul and the staff there. We're so excited to get to help bring this message of Simplify Soul Winning to you these next few weeks. Yes, you know, Simplify Soul Winning came about uh, as we began to travel several years ago. Um, we began to see that we were winning souls everywhere that we went. People began to ask us, you know, how do you do this? Uh, and so uh, one of the things that we discovered as we traveled is that most Christians have overcomplicated sharing their faith. Most Christians didn't know how to share their faith. They didn't know how uh, to go about it. And so one day as I was praying, the Lord gave me this phrase. He said, harvesting harvesters. Um, and, and really what that meant, that was a, a mandate from him uh, for us uh, with these seminars. What he was saying is that we would help equip others to go out and get out into the harvest. Yes. In Matthew chapter 9, verse 37 and 38, Jesus said that harvest is plentiful. He made that statement three different times, and we're going to... Uh, look at those three times during the course of this uh, seminar um, but the next very the next very next thing jesus says is but the laborers are few right. and then in the next verse he says pray the lord of the harvest to send out laborers into the harvest field and so uh, people began to ask us like i said how do we do this how do i share my faith and god really gave kara a very simple uh, way of explaining how to do what we were doing uh, and that's how this book and the uh, the book and the seminar came about uh, and we really saw the name it simplify soul winning so right and you know uh, in john 4 35 jesus tells us he said look up the harvest is ripe all around you and you know really that what that means is to look up literally and and so if you're looking down you're seeing your own problems your own worries your own world around you of, of hurts and whatever's going on but if you look up get your eyes off of yourself and your own circumstances and begin to look at the world all around you you'll start to see that the harvest is plentiful and um, and then god will begin to equip you and so we hope that you're here today to uh, help in that process and we're going to go over five principles that that i really that the lord gave me in this teaching and they are to be bold to be led to be compassionate to be yourself and to be prepared and as you learn those things we believe that fears you've had uh, over the years about soul winning and being a witness will just begin to crumble that some of the excuses maybe even you've had I'm I'm not a, a an evangelist or or whatever those are will begin to to crumble in your life and you'll begin to see wait a second I can do this thing called witnessing I can share my faith and it's really uh, not as complicated as I've made it out to be it can just be a normal expression and part of my life and when you get that when you start to understand that um, you'll begin to see the harvest come in all around you your friends your family co-workers we've had so many testimonies through these seminars we've done 23 now I, I believe you are the 23rd or 24th um, that we're uh, privileged to be able to do now equipping hundreds of harvesters, many of them have come to us and said, for the first time, I was able to lead somebody to the Lord, whether it was a, a serviceman coming into their house, somebody at the bus stop, their aunt, their daughter, and, and they got to share Christ with them and see them come into the kingdom of God. And so we are so excited to get to be a part of this soul winning journey with you and help equip you to do that in your life. Yes, yeah, so it's going to be a great time, so don't miss any of it. Uh, we will be with you, I believe, for the next uh, the next one and then one, uh, one other after that. So we are very excited to be there with you. Uh, so without uh, taking any more time, we want to go on and get into the Word. So thank you so much for coming, and uh, have a, a great uh, a great time. And yes. remember, harvest is plentiful. That's the first step, is understanding that harvest is plentiful it all is. around. Yes, there are people ready and ripe for the harvest. So we yeah. say to you, bon courage, bon courage. as you begin. Yeah. The study. Bye-bye.